Hi everyone, it's Ali again, and in this tutorial I'll go through how to use Lumium Pro 11, the student version. Um, this will be useful when you want to get some good renders of your design um, to make it more um, realistic and appealing. So, first of all, after you've downloaded Lumion, which is a big big program, so make sure you've got the space for it. Head over and click on examples to see what's already done and how what you can add and not add and stuff. So load up an example project. Um, we're gonna go with whoops. Must have double clicked that. No so that's fine, we'll go with this one. So loading up the example project. There we go. Got it open. As you can see, they've already got, you know, everything set, um, the house, um, the people and the fauna, the landscape and, you know, birds flying, setting, everything, so it's pretty good. Um, so the way you kind of move around is, this is me click holding on right click and, you know, panning over, so seeing what's around me, got some farmlands, got mountains in the background, so let's say move around, so right click, hold on to it and it allows you to move around, you can use, um, as you can see on the right, the shortcut, the WASD to move moving keys, you've got space to go slower as you're moving, I'll show you guys now, so, so I'm going WASD and then I hold the space, you go slower. Hold on shift goes faster. And if you hold on shift and space, you go double speed. Pretty handy, literally. Um, so that's how you kind of navigate around. You've got your um, build, photo, panorama, turn into a movie, files. You've got the stuff here, these functions, and then you've got the other components you can add. So, contents, you know, from models that you have from other programs, from nature, from fine detail. Um just gonna show you guys examples of what they look like. As you can see different kinds of trees, uh, pages of them, twenty pages of them, a lot of trees. We got you know loads, um different types, grass plants forest wood. Let's just get one for the sake of it. Let me just put it here onto our concrete. Like this is an example. Um, you've got rocks as well. Let's get this. This is huge, for example. I'm going to put this here. Like, why not? Big peak. So we're just we're just having fun with our rock placing. Um, got weeds. You can add. We don't like weeds though. Okay. You can use lighter thumbnails to you know see better what they are. Um, and then you got finer. Do you thought names? So are different kinds of spe specific. Um, Plants and trees. Um, you can favorite some just by click on the star. Um, I don't know what I want to do that. You know, people can add different kind of NBA players. Um, you know, doing various functions, various races of Africa. You got at least in. Um, <clears throat> then you got women, you got boys, you got girls, you got people static, just you know, pets, it's a nice cow. Um, other kinds of animals, like let's get a cow, let's put a cow, let's put a cow there.
It's a silhouette though, as you can see. Get a better car from here. It's an action, so it's more like a background thing. Um, yeah, we've got outdoor furniture you can add. We've got a transport. Just get a car we like. Mm, sports cars, yeah, definitely. Yeah, so it's like the Mustang GT, yeah, but that's it. Let me just snap this here. Um, we got SUVs, got buses, trucks, construction, boats, and ships, um, airplanes, uh, it's pretty cool. Get them to work. So we just keep it here. Well, that one too, we'll get rid of it all. Go and check out hot air balloon as well. Um, add some light to different parts of your site as well. You can also set your eye level at 1.6 meters, which is the average height. You know, get those people height perspective views and stuff. That's pretty good as well. Um, yeah, different kinds of fixtures of lights. You can add effects onto, you know, different effects, fountains. For example, let's get this um, whole fountain. So it's purple. It's a very poor place to put it, but you guys get the idea of it. Oh, they put some more inside as well. Great. Let's ignore that. <laughs> Um, gonna get fire as well. Nah, it's not for a fire like that. Not good, doesn't look good. Hmm, different shapes of fire as well, we can put in. Um, that's some utilities. Um, yeah, that's, that's what that's the components can add with some materials. So, click on, double click on the roof, for example, and it gives you the material and its properties. You know, the glass reflectivity, relief, and colorization, everything. So, change the color to whatever you like. Um, pretty good. Um, and then you can change the material, kind of into metal. Um, can make it this top metal, go make it this plastic top metal. Really, it's, it's whatever you can, whatever you like to do, you can do. That's a cool part of moving on. Um, you know, indoor, outdoor, really up to you. You can make a brick roof, don't, but you can. Um, add some grass, um, get a green roof. That. Well, there are better ways to do that, but it's for the sake of the video, you know. Um, so yeah, that's for materials. Back to the functions. That's landscape details as well. What's this? That's different, you know, brush strengths and sizes and whatnot. Um, it's currently on paint and add some terrain as well. Um, let's say flat and then you can jitter it and smooth it out. So you can see the spot will raise it a little for the second video. But now we're going to bring it down because that's super ugly. Do it too much. And this is just, just so there's a massive ditch there. Don't go there, people. Oh, that's a mortar. Make this top of water. Let's 
can see. Quite nice. So we added our own little dam there. Pretty cool. Um, navigation. You can also download um the landscape from OpenStreetMap, so you can get some OpenStreetMap data as well, which is quite cool. Um, you can change the weather, you know, make it make it darker, change the which what which way the sun is. Uh, you can put the sun's height down, make it darker. And it's completely night time now, so I don't want that. Make a good R there, that's quite nice. Um, get some real skies in. Kind of cool. Yeah. Um, but yeah, to tell we go about with this, these are the basics of um, Lumion. And now we're going to try to render what we have. So we're on build you know, a view now. So click on photo. And as you can see, you've got your view shown as realistic. So that's the style is on. You change the title of your thing, you change the style, the effects of you know the edit effects, you know, add, you can add more clouds, you can make that a more you can put that layout forward to make it more obvious, you can make it clouds high. You can really change a lot of things, you know. Really up to you. Um, you know, you can sharpen you know, the graphics and whatnot. Um, yeah, those are the things. So we're going to try to make a custom one so we can go through everything. Um, so on custom, you've got a bunch of scenarios set here, like daytime settings. Um, we'll go with realistic. No, let's just try out realistic, realistic. That's good. Um, then you can add over and store this view in your camera. So, so then we go to render and you've got you know, your current shot here and you've got the sizes you want to print out. And you've got a set of photos you can print it like as you know, get the others you can get the other photos as well. Um, but we're gonna go for the current shot. You know. Can add extra stuff to it as well. So we'll just go off print and just say render Lumion. Oh, Lumion. And save it. Now it's rendering, you know, good samples and um, just getting it as realistic as possible. As you can see, it's getting the good camera. So, render's complete. And, yeah, now I'll show you guys a little. Yeah, there you go. Quite nice. Very easy to use. Got a GT vector as well. Obviously, you can edit the can set the uh, quality of what you want to print it at uh, render it at, but it's decent quality for something that's very easy to use. So I hope this video helped out heaps. Um, I really like Lumion. Uh, and I hope you guys can also like and make use of it as much as you can. So thank you for watching.